Hello everyone, welcome to another segment of Waxhatchee Wednesday with Team Insini and Remax Realty Group. And today we're on location at a project home at Lake Waxhatchee. We're going to stop in and talk to Lacey Rogers with Living Right Designs, see what kind of project they've got going on. Let's see if we can find Lacey. All right, everyone, we caught up with Lacey. Lacey, how's it going? Good. Good, welcome to the segment. Thank you. Tell us about the home we're in right now and what you've been doing for the last year. Yes, we started um, on August last year with the initial plan on the layout, helped uh, all the finishes, lighting, furniture, and then all the all the custom details. Yeah. For the whole house. So it looks like you're getting close. We're almost there. How far out are you? <laughs> well, probably three more weeks. Three more weeks? Yeah. Okay. That's well, that's pretty cool. Uh, it's really awesome. I've seen some of the before pictures, mm -hmm. and what we see now is totally different. Yeah and the finished product is going to be amazing. So tell us a little bit about your company and what you do exactly. Okay. Because a lot of people don't know. I mean, you say interior design, people don't, they don't translate that to what it actually is. Right. A lot of people think it's decorating and they're like, oh, you get to go shopping for a living. And I'm like, oh no, not really. I'm always behind a computer or in <laughs> meetings all day. Um, but we're on really, the job site making sure yes, we do right. the job site checks and making sure they're actually following the documents that we do. Right. So the biggest thing is making the plans and then we exhaust everything and then the contractor just works on quality control. Right. They just make sure the guys are showing up, everything's getting installed correctly, and then we just, they don't have to worry about, does that cover look good with that color? Right. Does this light fixture, is that the right size? Sure. Like that. So how long have you been doing this? 10 years. 10 years? 10 years. What's your inspiration to get into this field? Uh, well, I've always been an artist. And I was doing murals and photography, and then everybody bring it off to college, right? And I was like, oh man, I don't know what I want to be when I grow up. <laughs> <laughs> and so um, I actually worked at Home Depot. Did you? And uh, the kitchen guy pulled me in and was like, you want to sit in on a presentation with me? And uh, so I sat in, and this this couple came in, and she looked just like my mom. The, her James Avery jewelry, like everything, <laughs> and I was just like, wow. And so he rolled out the you know, floor plan and I immediately, my mind just walked through it. Mm -hmm. And then Larry goes, so where's the front door at? And I was like, wow, I realized how kind of natural it came for me. And uh, anyways, her, the homeowner and I, we just had so much fun, like picking out the, right. the cabinetry and the granite and just went going and then went home, turned on HGTV and I was like, what am I doing with my life? Like, I need to do this for a living. And right. so I enrolled at the Art Institute of Dallas and I never looked back. Well, that's cool. Yeah. That's cool. So, do you just service at Waxhaven in Ellis County? Yeah, or? all over Dallas. We have oh, really? clients in Frisco, Fort Worth, wow. um, McKinney. Yeah. Okay. Most of them are in Ellis County. I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask Yeah, Ellis County is booming. Yes. Um, what do you like most about doing business in Ellis County? Because my family's here. Right. I have two little kids, and it's just nice to use local people like stained glass artists. Or like Restoring Texas is doing like this huge beam up here right. for us. Um, just using people in your neighbors. I mean, literally, they're my neighbors. Right. <laughs> people right. behind me or down the street. And you say that, and that's funny because we found out that we're neighbors. We're neighbors. <laughs> we didn't even know it. No, so, I love it. So that's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> awesome. So how does anyone get in touch with you if they want to talk to you about maybe doing a project? Well, we do an open studio night, like probably every other month just so people can come in. We'll have a whole project from you know, beginning to end on display. You can ask us any questions, we'll have wine and snacks, and then, um, but they can call and just tell me kind of what your dilemma is, right. you know, and if I can help you, and then we just get on the schedule. Have you ever sat in with anyone before they build a home oh, and yes. help them with that too? Oh no, that's where we really need to start. Like if you're yeah. thinking about starting a project, give us a call. Right. Because there's a lot of things like, Door swings and storage and like, you know, are you sure? You Things that people don't think about until the house is done and they're like, oh, wow, I should have done that. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to. I'm always that person you can call, bounce like, you know, I saw this light fixture on sale. Is it? And I'm like, it's too big. Don't. And then they're like, okay, fix it. Right. I'm like, just right. call me. We're good. Call a professional. <laughs> so, okay. Listen, if you're looking for someone to help you out with any design work. Uh, pre-build or you know you're buying a house and you want to rent yeah. right mm -hmm. they can call you we do decorating Get. custom window treatments shutters anything for the home all right yeah you might want to get in touch with Lacey and give her a call and sit down and have some coffee or some wine and you'll figure out if it's going to work out all right yeah. 
Hey, share this video with your friends and family. And if you are looking to buy or sell your home, or maybe both in Ellis County or 10 other counties, contact Tim and Senior. We'll sit down and talk with you. Thanks a lot. Bye.